right, all right, all right. For years and years now, the league been talking crazy about Mr. Number One Overall Pick, Maple Jordan, Andrew Wiggins. Andrew Wiggins ain't this. Andrew Wiggins ain't that. Well, guess what? He is a champion, the second best player on a championship team. Look at him. Look at him in his eyes. And well, I have replaced the current Andrew Wiggins via the NBA draft. As you can see, the draft has passed Andrew Wiggins number three. Sorry, San Antonio had to steal him from you. Don't worry, you got the fourth pick too. I have replaced his current self with the rookie Andrew Wiggins. The catch is though, is that unlike 2K knowing that Andrew Wiggins didn't become the next Michael Jordan. Yeah, that's exactly what I wanted to be. 99, 99, and 99. Absolutely foolproof. Unless he like tears his Achilles or something eight times. So congrats to the Golden State Warriors on your ring. And here's to the player that Steph Curry will be handing the reins of the franchise down to. Oh yeah, I forgot about Kuminga too. They might be a kind of a fire duo. Shout out to James Wiseman. Love the pictures of him holding the trophy. It reminded me of Kendrick Perkins holding the trophy. And I remember they were cooking Taylor and Horton Tucker. First season, they got Wiggins deep off the bench. They're starting Moses Moody over him. Also shout to Carl Towns, a great guy, you know. And I seen him tweet out, you know what I mean? Wigs, big wigs. Almost put Wiggins back on the Wolves, but you know, they won the ring last night. We'll keep the family close. I'm gonna just start picking new MVPs. Sorry, Luca. You've had enough simulations where you dominate. To be fair, you could always get injured or something though. So I'll let you. Yeah, I'm just kidding. Bradley Beal MVP. Oh, Wiggins was an abysmal human being this year. He shot 44. Actually, you know, that's not that bad, but three point percentage. That's pretty awful. Free throw, pretty awful. Six seed against Minnesota. Oh, wow. Maybe I should have put him on Minnesota. Wait, are we about to defeat them? It's a game seven. And you know, Wiggins isn't really going to play. So screw it. Uh, Towns beats us. Andrew Wiggins, nine points. But this is just the training arc. Don't worry. The Pelicans win the finals 4 to 2 over the Celtics uh, again. Oh my mellow, you bastard. You went to the Celtics of all teams. Welcome to the team, Keontae George. Just don't take Wiggins a minute. Andrew Wiggins, 81 overall, 20 year old. I mean, that's probably accurate. Dude was averaging like 20 out the gates. Wiggins is starting this year. Clay kind of fell off, and the team is the first seed right now, led by his 15. He's still shooting awful though. Okay, fine, Luca. You could have this one. I also wanted to bring back something today for the people who will never shut the hell up. I was giving Chuck a haircut when you reminded me to like okay i haven't put one of these comments on the screen in probably over a year yet it's still riddled in my comment section i ask of one thing make this say subscribe and not like i don't care about no like oh hey markel fold six man of the year it hasn't been long since you got your video what has it been a week just letting all the number one overall picks rock where's my andrew wiggins all nba selection second c can we beat beat dallas and luca uh i have a feeling that we're about to lose this game i was right my my hunch was correct we lost by Four. Wiggins had 25 in game seven, though. The arc is continuing. He's coming more and more battle tested as my god, Luka Doncic. Hey, fine. You had to win your ring, too. Good for you, but just no more. Kevin Love retired. Ah, uh, yes. My favorite small forward slash center, LeBron James. I bet Wiggins at 85 overall this season. He taking over to 84. Close enough. Honestly, should have won a ring by now. Now, this version of Andrew Wiggins, he's ringless, but you know, I, I couldn't give him one day to celebrate. Nah, bro. I'm getting you back to work one day after. Oh, yeah. Ring Restart your career. Sorry for the eight years you just put in. Big LaMelo season. Yeah, that's right, Luca. Yeah. Darren Jackson sprained right toe. I don't really get it. Why don't you just like get a new one or something? Andrew Wiggins progressing more and more. Um, I mean, his teams are better than his Wolves teams ever were in real life. But that aside, as an average, he's actually probably scored less points. Come on, Memphis. You know, yes. Thank you. Thank you. And oh, New Orleans. You about to beat the Pelicans? Okay. Wiggins third year champion. Yeah. Oh, Chris Paul's back on the Rockets. Why? Wait, they got Wiseman? How did we lose Wiseman? Wiseman, what did we do to lose Wiseman? I don't understand. He played his four, three years, and you let him go. What? Oh well, actually, he didn't. He didn't play in one of the years, but that's that's beside the point. Chris Paul, forty years old, one more matchup against Stephen Curry, and so far he's getting cooked. And Chris Paul, sorry, bro, should have played in a different era or something. Maybe you could have beat like Jason Kidd or something. Jalen Brown in the Cavaliers, a bit terrifying, but this is Andrew Wiggins' league. Game one to Colin Sexton, the God in the Cavs. He's also the sixth man but he that didn't keep him from dropping 40. A win is a win though as we get the second one back. Wiggins 20, 10, and 8. My God. Stephen Curry is injured. What the hell happened? Pinch nerve in the back season, but he, he's still playing. Man, it's playing with no mobility. He can't even stretch. He ain't even stretched. Do, do, uh, Wiggins 20. Andrew Wiggins, a career high 35 points as it says on the, the, the dude in the top left. Hashtag making history. Can this be it? No. Can this one be it? No, of course not. We're really about to blow through and lead to the Cavs again. Oh my God. They just came back. Look at the fourth quarter, 15 to 26. Some, whatever I just said, I don't know if that was correct, but 30 seconds left and they are fouling Jalen Brown. They have no more chances. No more time to wait, I guess. Curry is not in the game. His injured self is on the bench, at least for right now. Pass in. Oh, 
Oh, my Jordan pull, man. Pull. All you had to do was chuck a three up, and we are about to blow a three. Wiggins, how you let this happen? What did you do in this game? 24 points. Good shooting. Hey, it looks like he took over the second best player on the team role again in this simulation, but it does not matter. Pull shoots a fadeaway three. It is off, and that is it. I am not watching the Cavaliers celebrate this championship. Enjoy it, but I won't be here. I'm walking out of the stadium. 26 points from Wiggins and a complete sellout. I feel like LeBron would sooner head to Guangdong than Indiana. I still don't know why we lost James Wiseman, but screw it. He's probably not going to be that good anyway. So, hey, you never know. Maybe he does the Embiid thing. Andrew Wiggins. Oh, yeah. It's almost time. 88 overall. We got Nikola Jovic. Nikola Jovic. Andrew Wiggins, one time All Star as the team is the second seed in the league. Well, that looks like, oh, man, oh, man. Andrew Wiggins, 26. He's taking over. It's his team now. 26, 6, and 3 a game. Hey, put him on the MVP race. Let me see the, oh, you bastards. A broken left ankle. He can't be here no more. Put Wiggins. Oh, he's not going to win most improved because we let Moses Moody lead and he's going to win it instead, huh? In the comments section, let me know who is your favorite mid NBA player. I don't mean to discredit Andrew Wiggins, but when I think of number one overall, I don't really think of Andrew Wiggins as a bust. I just think he didn't, he wasn't a number one overall pick level. You know what I'm saying? He's not a superstar. He's not a transcendent franchise player, but you know, me, me personally, I would give Harrison Barnes the key to the state of America. Andrew Wiggins, all NBA second team. Sorry, Kevin Durant. We got a new dog in town. Yeah, I'm be honest, <laughs> it looks crazy for KD's resume. Like as people in the world, like we're always like, oh wow, KD, like we gonna rank him top whatever the hell. Cause we're like, man, he got two rings. But do we remember? He won the first one with Harrison Barnes and the second one with Andrew Wiggins replacing him. Like, ah, ah. I don't know, man. Uh, second overall seed in the conference. Oh no, we got the black screen of death, but I bet we still could chris middleton chris middleton would be a great fit on the grizzlies i have this i have this theory right i personally think as a person with two carmelo anthony autographs in their room as the warriors lose in the first round wiggins what did you do? i know job ja morant's great but okay yeah no he almost averaged 50 he, he averaged 48 39 and 80 82 splits with fantastic numbers i can't blame him who can i blame marvin bagley of course a, a, another bust do i need to do a marvin bagley career recently and by the way i love how much hype there is for jordan Poole yet 2k like doesn't care they probably made this card at the beginning of the year or this player or this model or whatever the hell and he kind of just stays in 83 overall the entire simulation people are like oh do the jordan pool career sim i'd have to bump up his potential crazy Cade cunningham finals mvp wiggins where are you at coach that's a joke oh there goes draymond 70 overall retired nah he didn't play for the lakers harrison barnes retired bruno caboclo jordan bell a oh, man warriors legend fun fact but i used to be a pretty big warriors fan not like a fan over the knicks just a fan as well Wiggins is a 93 overall. Let's check the Hall of Fame badges he's racking in. Posterizer, volume shooter, and glue hands. Of course, glue hands. He seemed like he would have glue hands. You now, a few months before Curry dropped 54 on the Knicks, I became a huge fan of Duke because he was shooting the lights out like nobody else, right? And, and now, what I really remember is how garbage this man's jump shot was in NBA 2K13. Holy hell. Okay, Jabari, Jabari Smith makes the all-star starters before Wiggins, but you know, we're the first seed, so we don't know what you're talking about. Wiggins, the MVP race yet? No. No. Why? Because he doesn't pass. Oh, okay. See, now LaMelo, you can't just take Luca's spot as Luca. No, no, no. You could have that for now, but I'll be watching. Don't worry. Ryan trust. In Ryan, we trust. Wiggins made not a not a hint of all NBA team this year, but that's okay. Jonathan Isaac injured, of course. We make it back to the finals. A Pelicans move, please. Thank God. They almost just came back from 3-1. I was going to PTSD of the Cavs series. Both of them. And the Kings are up three. Who the hell? Let me restart the game. We got to, you know, we got to see the full vibration. Vibracious. I, 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 well, guess what? I've restarted start the game three times and it keeps bringing me back to the screen all right fine then just cook us and get it over with whatever man we know we lost hold on wait maybe i lied oh okay we blew it th we, they, they blew a 3-1 lead that's that's a nice refreshing thing and the pistons Cade cunningham deer and fox sadiq and jabari smith my god they don't have a center but i mean the fantastic fantastic squad now if we lose back-to-back -back finals it's a pretty bad look somehow almost came back within the last like 0.5 seconds but i'm lost just don't hit a three don't hit okay cool cool we're good uh we won the second game Ke keon Keontae, Ke yeah, Keontae George, dude who was drafted with or after Wiggins. Hey, thanks. That's our little future big four right there. You see Curry only had to have 13 points in this game. He's a 91 overall. He's still like the almost the best player, but another win. Take a 42 from Wiggins. I'm not gonna lie. I actually thought we were gonna lose. Yet Wiggins is 34 and Kuminga's 33 has got us in another 3-1 lead. You know what? I'm just gonna click it. We gonna win. Thank you. Th Andrew Wiggins, finals MVP, 31-8-4 a game in the finals. That is an all-time finals run right there 28 in the final one and look at how many points we
we won this one by. This is over 40 points of a win. 45 to be exact, I think. Unless I said, no, I think that was 44, actually. Sorry, Bowl Bowl. Sorry to the Pistons. But yeah, survival of the fittest, Andrew Wiggins. And Stephen Curry is going to retire on that note. Dude has suffered with some ankle injuries. He even pinched his nerve in the back now uh, for two seconds. He's calling it quits. He's officially handing off the, the keys of the team to Mr. Wiggins. Honestly, I thought Wiggins would be a free agent, but I guess he already signed his uh, his max extension. I did not realize that. Oh, wow. He actually signed it with a player option. But he's only got two years left uh, guaranteed on this team, and the team is much worse for sure. But he's a 96 overall, 24. Ah, look, it's, it's, I, I know RJ said he retiring this nickname, but you know, we got the Maple Mamba and we got Maple Jordan right next to each other on the All-Star team. Wow. And we got Scotty Barnes. He's in Canada too. And we got Shea. Why is Canada taking over? The okay, maybe we should relax at this point. Luca winning MVP is averaging a, a light 25. Oh, wow. 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 Okay, this is bad. I was just looking through who else could win the MVP. And well, Wiggins, you'd have been a great candidate. But Jonathan Kuminga, how many games did he play? He played 73 games, averaging 26 points. A fantastic duo with Wiggins until he dislocated his right patella. And he's now out for the rest of the season. And the team was struggling even with him still playing. Forget all these awards. Wiggins third team. I don't really care though. But even without with him playing for most of the season, we were kind of struggling without Steph. We're in the playing game. I'm going to try resetting this one more time. There we go. Against Minnesota with Malachi Flynn starting in point guard now with uh, what's his name? Steph gone. And we lost to the Timberwolves and are done. We are out of the playoffs. Edwards dropped 54 on Wiggins and company and a 4-1 series win by the Kings over the Knicks. Oh, we drafted Stephen Moore to help us out with the 11th pick. He'll probably do nothing. Kuminga is probably going to recover in two seconds. I don't think he's still injured, but Wiggins 97 overall 25. A ring, you know what I mean? Already on the mantle or a championship on the mantle and Hall of Fame badges in every single category. He always loved his deep mid ranges. Let's just hope he's hitting them at the Kobe clip now. Andrew Wiggins, all-star starter for the first time ever. Show me the MVP race. He's not here. And LaMelo made his way to Los Angeles where his brother once res resided or the whole family, I guess, because old Cali close and I, I don't know. Do they live in LA? I don't know. They were, do have ever been to Cali? No. Victor Wenbanyama, the most valuable player. I don't know why I'm saying it in this accent. Uh I was trying to find something else cool, but I didn't find nothing. The mellow ball, Giannis, Andrew Wiggins. You ever gonna make the first team? I don't care. You're doing great on the second. Numbers looking all right. And you're the second seed this year. Okay, what changed this year? That's what we need to figure out, right? Isaiah Stewart's here, maybe for the first time ever. Oh, Nyeko Kongwu is here for the first time ever. That's cool. Got some new center corpse out here. And Zach Levine, a 78 overall shooting guard. Never heard of this guy before. He's probably okay at shooting. It looks like he is. Might have just hit like 13 threes in a game once or something. And we're about to lose to the Rockets in the first round. God, we are we are an abomination to basketball. Holy hell. And again, they did go on to win to the, go to the finals at least. And um, their team is, you know, Jalen Green, Amani Bates, who everybody hates nowadays. Um, as you could see by the fact that he was drafted with the first pick in the second round. Yeah, fell off a cliff. I don't know what else to say about that. Andrew Wiggins re-signed for four years, 198 mil. Good for him. The team he's won a ring on, he's probably, you know, is it impartial or partial when you like, when you have favor for, I don't know, man, Google definitions it's partial i like i like learning you know expand the vocabulary so earlier i was gonna say i have a theory right and my theory is that as much as i love carmelo anthony got two of his autographs in my room right i think that carmelo anthony would have been best suited if he got drafted in the modern era as a player who watched all his prime years as a young chap he shot us out of a lot of games and he wasn't a good passer he wasn't a good defender right i think Melo would have been the greatest chris middleton ever i think if Melo was in the Giannis chris middleton role they'd win six rings like he wasn't Jordan, he was Pippen, but probably better skill wise, offensively, we'll say that much. Not defensively, obviously, you know, he's not a better player than Pippen. Pippen won six rings. You know, we're not seeing Melo over no Pippen on no list. He's probably top 75, top, you know, 60 ish, and Pippen's about top 30, 35. But yeah, that's just my theory of the day. I think if Melo got drafted in like 2016, it, it, it would be different ball game. People always like, oh, snap, Melo should barely be top 75. I think if he was on a good team, and then we'd be like, oh, this is a young dude who's been a fantastic six second option averaging 22 a game next to like a guy like Giannis and wins four rings he'd be top 50 top 40 but you know you can make a scenario like that for almost every player wait Gian is Giannis on the Rockets last year no they're just gonna cook it's even worse that's great Wiggins averaged 30 this year somehow he fell on the all NBA teams averaging 30 but we won't talk about it hey Bronny how you doing wow you made it for you Wiggins I also saw he made the all defensive second team that's an accomplishment and we're the sixth seed against OKC and we won in the first round win in the second round we're up three to two three to three 
and we lost. We blew a 3-2 lead. Wiggins 35 against MVP LaMelo Ball. A solid, a valiant effort. James Wiseman finals MVP. Oh my God. Andrew Wiggins, 99 overall. I don't know why his speed with ball is getting worse. I also don't know why it's only a 76. But almost everything else is just straight 99s because you get, that's what happens when you're 99 overall, you know? Philadelphia's finest shot, Moran. Back in the playing game again. Man, we are great, aren't we? Okay, cool. Seven seed against Sacramento and we uh, we got cooked in seven games. I don't care about no Valiant effort, man. Marvin Bagley, if you don't, I don't know who Killian Mashi is, but 37% is not going to cut it. Oh, hey, Quentin Grimes. He had a pretty viral tweet yesterday about the Drake album. He said, this is exactly what I need for this summer. And then the next tweet was, never mind. Isaac Okoro, are you here to help the team or just sit around? I swear to God, this game simulates slower than Nikola Jokic on a fast break. Better than Julius Randle on a defensive recovery. Andrew Wiggins is actually an MVP P race. Wow, he's getting his respect. Never mind. Fifth seed against Denver. And cool, we made out the first round and we lost in the second round. We're really good. Solid, you know, first round upset and everything. But man, we still out here losing to Luka. Hasn't he got old by now? Miami champions over OKC. What is this, 2012? One year, 53 mil left. Maybe you want to leave this team. Or DeAndre Aiden just signed here and you want to stay, I guess. Andrew Wiggins, all-star captain. Team's the second seed. This is looking like the MVP season. Come on, you bet. Where the hell is he? Who is Jackson Davis? Who, who are you? Ed Davis's superstar nephew is going to take over Andrew Wiggins' reign. Get Scoot Henderson out of here. Now, you know what? Fine, if he's better than Wiggins, then he's better. I mean, Wiggins ain't winning no rings. Uh, you know what I mean? So, at least not in a long time. He makes the third team, averaging 28 points per game. And we are going to the playoffs as the third seed. Wiggins against Sacramento. The first round is a solid first round. Able to win that. Dallas in the second. Luka Doncic never, you know, sleep on Luka. But uh, game seven, we win. I had a good feeling about that. I don't know why. I usually don't. But uh, Kay Kylan, whatever the hell your name was, Mishi, he did play. He played great. And Aiden, 12 and 12. That's all we need from you, you know? Wiggins, a conference finals against OKC. And we win 4-2. And oh my God, it's the Warriors versus Celtics. Well, we might be on the same screen, but I did take like an hour in between this recording because I was rudely interrupted. And then I went and took my dog for a walk and it started thundering while I was walking my dog. She started running. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. Um, 99 overall, Andrew Wiggins. Can he cook? Can he, they've been saying he locked down. Can I be honest? I've been getting my sleep schedule right. right. I missed a lot of the finals games. I didn't see him have J Jason Tatum in purgatory confine or, or solidary, solitary confinement. We're about to see if he can do it virtually again. But I've, I've heard, I've heard around the block that, uh, that he had Jason Tatum in fits. I also saw that Jason Tatum's the first NBA player to ever have a hundred turnovers in a postseason. 31 and 19 from Wiggins to Tatum 16 and 10 on three for 11 shooting. Yep. It stays true to form. But I think, did we just lose? I, I think I saw them win. I don't know. Looks like we're about to win this one though. Unless, unless they score like right. Yeah. Hey, let's jump in. I want to see prime Wiggins. We have not been able to see this man in full form. Film the 2K camera angle again recently. So here we are. Is that Bam Adebayo on the Celtics? You see that center, that number 13? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it is. Kuminga guarded by Tyler Hero. Where the hell did you come from? But he misses. Celtics just took all of the Heat's players. Look at Bam Adebayo dribbling the ball. Tyler Hero throws it away. Daniel Gafford with the steal throws up to a coral, and that is it. Tyler Hero fumbles. Didn't have to see Wiggins do nothing at all. Oh my God, he dropped 50. I didn't have to see the 50, but he dropped the 50. And Bam just hit it out of bounds. It's her ball again. Yeah, um, yeah, Warriors win. That is Wiggins. It ties his career high in points and probably his career postseason high. I had to make a educated guess. Yeah, never mind about earlier. I was wrong. We're actually up to, uh, oh my, yo, someone just hit a game winner. That's my fault. Oh my, look at this man, Kuminga. I thought the game was over. They came back. You know, some 2K stuff happened, but game winner by Kuminga. Three point shot made, and we are going to win in seven. I mean, in seven, a seven game series. In four games, too. Andrew Wiggins, 36 and 11, the lead a team to the championship. No Curry, no problem. It took him six years, but he's back and wins his second finals MVP. So in this universe, Curry actually retired with no finals MVP. Sorry, Steph. I mean, he could have if you include the ring that happened yesterday, but it didn't happen in the game. Santi Aldama retired. And guess what? The bastard left. Andrew Wiggins is gone. After winning the championship, he dipped out. Remember when I said there was one year left? Yeah. And you want to know where he went? I already did a little scouting and found it out. He went to the New Orleans Pelicans with Zion Williamson, a 33-year-old Zion. Four-year, $234 million contract. Zion averaged 30 last season and whoever the hell else all these other people are. He's taking his decadal turn into the age of 30. Zion's regressing a little bit. And, you know, he decided that unlike Kawhi, who went from Toronto to California after winning a championship, he decided, hey, I'm going to go from California to um, Louisiana. But, you know, he probably saves a couple dollars on taxes. Oh, my God. What the hell have I done? We, we got the, the double rainbow, the double Scoot Hendersons all the way. Where the hell did you both come from? Been in the league for, hey, you know what? They've been in the league for 10 years and I never noticed them. 
<laughs> you guys suck. Pelicans. Oh, wow. We played the Lakers first round. Wait, no. Well, why did I think we were on the Lakers for a second? I, maybe I was thinking of a different video. I don't know. Did the Warriors make it anywhere close? No, I don't see them. Not even in proximity. All right, Kuminga. I guess you weren't ready for prime time. We got the uh, the Mavericks next round. Luka Doncic. That is a 3-1 blown lead. You love to see it. 40 point loss. Whitehead, Doncic, and Proctor gave us buckets. And Wiggins. 15 points on 6 for 27 shooting in the last... What the hell? 4-2 to two, Chicago. Uh, or my bad. Ma Mavericks beat Chicago. Has Wiggins ever been injured? I know I have injuries on, but like he never... Man's an Iron Man. I ain't seen him injured in one playoffs. Okay, he actually missed a lot of games this season. Or at least a decent amount. Most ever. Uh, missed a couple games in this one. And that's really it. I'm pretty much an Iron Man. Mm, nice. We signed an old man, Shea Gilgis from Indiana. Oh, great. I'm happy to help you out. What the hell is SB? Who the hell is SB? Okay, so we're the second season. Who made it past the first round? Did I even say anything about MVPs or anything? Did I just keep it pushing? Shea is a little sprained right knee, but he's old. You know, day to day stuff, little kinks in the nooks and crannies that has nothing to do with injuries, but I don't know what I'm saying right now. Zion averaged 25. Shea is averaging 16 in the regular season. Wiggins averaging 24. Nice little big three we got going. This dude averages 17 in the playoffs. And second round against the Lakers. We beat them last year. We also beat Dallas this year. I don't know if Luka like left them or something. Uh, no, no, they just suck. And it's 3 3 against the Lakers. We won game seven bada bing bada boom we're in the finals the conference finals against denver scoot henderson one of the two is there two bams too because i've seen a different one no i'm playing it's obviously the same bam we just made a little move over to the western conference and we're going to lose 4-0 we got body shay and zion both healthy scoot henderson even got injured but uh this thing oh they got jabari smith too yeah but like we should have been able to stand toe to toe it wouldn't at least win one game the hell i don't know man well you guys better win the ring oh god they almost lost but they won they got Don Donovan Mitchell, Davion Mitchell, and Dylan Mitchell. Donovan Mitchell retired. Wiggins is sitting alone. He took a risk. A game to a team with two stars, or at least one signed here. And um, oh wait, hold on. You see who just joined this team? An old friend, Isaac Okoro, our fellow champion. Zion already won a ring too, and uh, Shea has none. Can you wig it? Who the hell is Xavier Booker? I just saw Darvin Ham win a uh, coach of the year. Hopefully that's a good sign for Lakers fans. How you doing, Bronny? That's true. They don't even got Darvin Ham in the game yet as the coach. So that means that the men just pulled up anyways. And he's coaching Boston. Six seeded against the Lakers, and we lost first round. Everybody healthy. I don't know why this guy's in the G League still. If he's a 79 overall, I don't know. But the Bucks win the championship. Liviu Constantine. Evan Booker, broken left leg. He going into retirement on crutches. Andrew Wiggins. He joins the team that has, I think, bounced this maybe twice. At least once, aka this year. Andrew Wiggins got tired of the New Orleans, Louisiana life. The quote-unquote LA life. You know, because that's like their abbreviation or whatever the hell they're yeah like in, in terms of states la louisiana but that that threw me for a loop once when i was a kid and uh, now we are in la again the real la or the fake la i don't know with lamello ball and aj dip de the who the bonsta the bonsta tsa tsa the bond tsa they call him tsa because he's that good at defending the basket we're going into season number 87 dang i haven't counted out the seasons in a video in a long time i used to do that every video season number 15 for Mr. Andrew Wigginton. Wait, can I see the all-star teams now knowing that there's duplicates? I, I see the two scoots. I see the two Anthony Black. There's two Victor Wenbanyamas too? Man, you guys are awful. We are in the multiverse. Big scoot. Jared Jack, coach of the year. And we lost in the first round. Wait, was somebody injured? I just looked at... Oh my... Ooh. Oh, wow. Wiggins, Wiggins literally just broke his leg in the fifth game of this series. So actually, we're still sellouts. Played 15 minutes in this last game, but uh, we still lost in the first round. The man broke his leg. His first major, major injury. Major key. No DJ uh, in the center. Victor Wenbanyama. Wenbanyama. DeAndre Aiden retired. Our former teammate of like one second. The team was working so well, you know. We didn't have to leave. Oh, yeah. So Wiggins is regressing. I just looked at it. Saw it. Didn't say anything. Wiggins is... Um, oh, wow. We signed Scotty Barnes, though. This might be the year to win another one. Yo, Andrew has averaged uh, like high 20s his entire career, yet has never dropped any more than 50. I find that really interesting. He's had like the KD Steph level of scoring because like KD's never dropped more than like 52. Steph was at 54 for years. I don't even know which scoot is which at this point. Oh my god, bro. Can I can I see that clip? I gotta see my dog again in the flesh. You see who that is? You probably recognize him from the My Career storyline this year. That is my guy, the 2K14 agent, my childhood hero. Wiggins still 26 a game at 35. Will OKC cook us again? No. Denver, will you? No. The, oh, it, it might really be the year. Didn't I say this is the year do we still have scotty barnes yeah um wow we're here scotty's even the sixth man right now behind this
this dude and uh the team's looking beautiful we're playing the celtics again in the finals a new team but same dogs with uh, dupe dupe uh, and victor win banyama be great if one of these guys was on this team with each other hold on why am i clicking simulate why am i just screw it i'm committed we are down 3-0 this is supposed to be the year and we are about to get swept by boston john moran 85 years uh, 85 years old yes finals mvp my offspring retired holy hell we are old and i think Lamelo might have just retired because he's not here anymore did he retire no but he's not here he dipped so uh, i can't blame him game is old as hell season number 17 does wiggins have one more left in the tank wiggins though holding down the team i wouldn't say Lamelo was the issue since we just made the finals but uh and also we lost the first game to his former team well not in this career his former team but his former team in a different life but uh we're at the second seed still even with Lamelo gone and guess what we're about to lose in the first round to the minnesota timberwolves yeah Lamelo definitely wasn't the problem nobody injured everybody healthy and we still suck and the celtics about to win another championship scotty barnes retired wiggins left again he joined the mavericks sure why not uh go and be luca you know what i mean his luca probably retired a few years ago go take his hand-me-downs and oh my god this team is incredible he's getting old he'll still be good he's at 93 but uh we got a great big three with scoot henderson and the other dude i already forgot the name of andrew wiggins is still an all-star captain in year 84 andrew wiggins he finally got it his mvp 29 points at a 93 overall seven rebounds for his most assist ever in old man development okay fine uh it might not be his, it, it's close to his most lost a lot of his hall of fame badges he still got bullet passer though it does not matter whatever the hell he got he finally did it scoot henderson and scoot henderson i don't care i'm just happy you, you, look you've had a pretty good career i can't lie you've won two rings you got an mvp shoot that's what kd got and we are in the conference finals and the second i announce it we're about to get beat by the spurs aren't we oh wait yep no there it goes inevitable edwards you're, you're solid Bronny james and will you get a ring yes they do Bronny james finals mvp edwards called it quits right after that jesus team is still solid i still got hope hey 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 we made it to the conference finals just to lose to the spurs that's okay that was a, that was still still very very respectable years from mr drew and that's it andrew wiggins only a year removed from his mvp season has retired from the dallas mavericks i'm not gonna lie this is one of the illest career i don't know bro winning an mvp a year before you retire it's your first whenever you're like eh, I'm, i know i'm nice see ya didn't get injured much he averaged 25.7 rebounds four assists 51 from the field 44 from three 79 for 80 percent from the line six triple doubles that's crazy that man do not like the pass 330 double doubles but of all those doubles uh, 330 times he could have got 10 assists but he said no dropped 53 in a game he beat it in one of the recent seasons one mvp two championships 16 all-star appearances three first teams six second team five third made a lot of defense too but uh i don't know how to you know i, I can't you know what this game is right it can't go any further used to love going through all these but now uh it cuts off here then again what else would really be here rookie team i don't even know if he made that well andrew wiggins uh, the league history records he ends up with the 10th most points ever scored more points than uh one of the many scoot hendersons and kobe he didn't set no crazy playoff record in scoring or nothing like that but he held it down almost a 30 point per game guy for uh 18 seasons he actually the 34 000. he could have got up to like seven if he just played the last two years you know actually he played 19 years that's a lot of years yeah you go ahead bro enjoy retirement his most assist ever in a game was 11 and uh 19 rebounds very wiggins-esque hall of fame inductees mr andrew wiggins the one the only the lone hall of fame inductee in 2041 imagine you had like the whole hall of fame ceremony it's just him and some like college coach from 1976 and like a mop boy that they wanted to like really you know give give love to and jersey will be retired number 22 with the warriors i don't know why it says he had two stints in the middle of his one stint i also don't know why it says he played there for 15 years what the hell is it doing like I, oh it's probably confused by the fact that he was there in real life too but yeah that is it thank you for watching you can like and subscribe to the channel it's youtube man you know what the hell buttons to press shout out to scoot henderson and i'm gonna get the hell up and out of here uh